guys, my name's Miss Mosley and I'm the lead teacher of science at Merston Park. We have a really, really exciting science programme here at Merston based around sort of developing the scientific skills that you need to become a really great scientist. In year seven, we start with an introductory module where you learn about health and safety in the lab and you learn how to use some of the scientific equipment like the bumps and burners. And then throughout year seven, we do a range of biology, chemistry and physics topics using equipment like microscopes, um, electricity, looking at acid and alkalis and neutralisation and loads more. Hope to see you guys next year. Now what I should be able to do if I charge up one of you guys, it should make all of your hair so nice and red. This works really well with people with longer, thinner hair. Could you try Daisy? Daisy, do you mind? Right Daisy, you need to come and stand in that tray. So both feet in the tray. Lovely. Hands on the dome. Before I start, you don't have a pace you don't have a cochlear implant. Something in your heart, something in your ear. No, you're all good. Right. Now, as Daisy does this, what I want you guys to be looking for is looking if you can start to see her hair standing up. We're also going to see if we can give Daisy some magic powers. We're going to see if we can make Daisy levitate some paper. Okay. Um, when you're being charged up, don't move your hands or anything like that until I say so. Okay? I'm scared. You'll be absolutely <laughs> fine. It doesn't hurt. We're going to hurt you. So, as this, ch this charge is building up, that is then making Daisy charge. As Daisy becomes charged up, what that means is all of her hairs. Can you feel her hair? Can you feel her? Can you see her hair going? Oh, I can't see it. So, oh, it feels warm. <laughs> so it's starting to go. It's starting to stand up really nicely, actually. And the reason why that's happening, guys, is because all of her hair has got the same charge. Now you probably know that light charges repel and push away from each other, yeah? That's why hairs are doing, they're pushing away from each other because they want to be as far away from hair from as possible. Now in a moment, Daisy, what I'm going to ask you to do is take your left hand off the dome, so be kind, and then just hold it above the paper and you're going to see if you can make the paper dots. Okay, do that now. Keep your right hand off. There you go. <laughs> that is because Daisy is all charged up, so she is making that move through the charge that is from her. Okay, I'm going to turn it off.